You were meant to wait inside. I cannot hide forever. I must face them. Back inside now. No. Geralt gave the signal from the woods and Triss hasn't cast the spell. Damn it. All right, run to her. Just a quick warning, there may be some spoilers in this video. There aren't many games where I actually find quite an emotional attachment to a lot of the characters. And I've actually cut quite a lot out of this. It was a really quite a long set piece, so it would have gone on for only 40 minutes and it was fantastic was this battle. One of the characters actually dies and it's such a strange thing, I actually felt really quite sad and quite strange when it actually happened. Because yeah, I've been playing this game for 60 odd hours now, is it 68 hours, something like that. You actually become attached to some of the characters and get to really learn and get to know that, that character type. And that's one of the amazing things in Witcher. They've all got a backstory, they've all got a history, they've all the dialogue and everything is extremely well written. And what you're gonna see in the next few clips is some cutscenes from it, which I just thought were really, really cool and I shall comment a little bit further in. But just uh, enjoy some of these visuals and cutscenes now, which is all in game by the way. And if you notice any little textures coming in slightly late, that's purely due to me recording, it doesn't actually happen in game. Head back. Stone I gave you. Eskos, open the gate! We can retreat beyond it! Fall back. You're not supposed to be out here. Too late now. They're coming in through the gaps! Time Meridian bombs. You'll find more in the crates by the walls.
she'll not abandon you. You humans are so impractical. Siri, no! Forbid you! You always were an unruly child. I adored that about you. I... I was too late to help him. It's not your fault. 
I should not have fled here to Kermorhen. Avalark is weak, but alive. Triss is tending to the others. I nearly killed you. Killed everyone. We'd all be dead if not for you. No, Geralt. The hunt would never have come to Kaer Morhen if I wasn't here. Bezimir's funeral. We should prepare. Yourself. No witcher's ever died in his own bed. As I mentioned earlier, this was really quite emotional to actually play, actually. Vesemir was a really good character. He was your master, your sensei. Uh, very defined character who was with you from the very beginning. And it's kind of strange that a computer game can evoke that kind of emotion. It's almost like a Hollywood film. And uh, I really cannot... Um, encourage you more to get this game if you haven't tried it it really is an absolute and i don't say this word very often it is a masterpiece honestly of digital entertainment it's better than any film i've ever seen it was just such an absolutely fantastic game and uh, i can't wait to continue get further into it much further into it and do the expansions and the rest of the stories so let me know in the comments if you enjoy witcher 3 definitely honestly i can't I keep gushing over this game how incredible it is and uh, hats off to uh, the developers outstanding your last respects to your friend then we must hold counsel <laughs> 